Jarl Kubot here with West USA Realty and Arizona 55 Plus Communities. I'm in the 5545 Plus Retirement Community of Sunland Village East in Mesa. I'm going to give you a tour of a brand new listing that I have here behind me. So hang on to your eyeballs. I'm going to give you some live, raw, unedited, lots of blooper video. So here we are standing in front of this home. It's on the uh, south side of the street facing north. It's uh, two bedrooms, two bath, plus a den off the laundry room. The master bedroom was extended six foot uh, when the original owners built it, as well as that back laundry room area. They added about eight feet onto the back of that. Um, very nice home. The roof was done in the last 10 to 12 years. It's a 35 year architectural shingle. Uh, the heat pump uh, was replaced. The heating and cooling was replaced on the home last week. A $9,000 heating and cooling system. Brand new in the home. Uh, the windows were replaced in the last 10 years. All new vinyl dual pane windows. All the flooring, the kitchen has been redone. New appliances in the home. Just everything is done and ready to move in. The garage has a golf cart room, but they're using it as a workshop. Kind of hard to get you in there off of pictures, but very nice. We have a wood burning fireplace that the current owners have been using on a regular basis. Uh, so uh, hang on and we'll uh, take you inside this home. We have a gate on the east side of the home here that uh, easier access to your backyard. It is a 200 amp electrical panel, all copper wiring which is standard for these homes. The whole exterior has been repainted um, in the last few years, as well as uh, we've got aluminum soffit and fascia all the way around the house. So very low maintenance on the exterior of this home. And you're a short distance away from the community center, tennis courts, swimming pools, fitness center. The current owners extended this front patio. It's epoxy coated. Uh, and again, this faces north. So a very nice place to sit and have your morning coffee. We have a gate on the west side of the garage. Just behind that gate is where they set the garbage can so you don't have to keep it uh, inside the garage. And we're just looking at this front patio from a different angle. I'm standing at the front of the home with the front door to my back, looking across the street. I'm looking actually down the street to the east. And these are the homes, your neighbors, straight across the street to the north. And then looking up the street to the west. And again, very short distance from the community fitness center, swimming pools, uh, library, uh, community hall for all your activities throughout the winter. So we're standing just inside the front door looking in towards the formal living room slash uh, dining room straight ahead and into the kitchen. Uh, the current owners have opened this up to give it a more open feel plan. And as we step inside, there is the wood fireplace, and the current owners have been using that. This has a laminate flooring. Everything's been repainted recently inside the house, floor to ceiling. There's no popcorn ceilings throughout the home. Standing in the dining room area, looking back towards the front of the home, the formal living room, there's your fireplace. They got a large TV above the fireplace sitting on the manifold and then uh, there's uh, looking back towards your front door there's a security door on that front door very nice security door standing back uh, with my back against the fireplace looking back towards the front door looking into the dining room and that opening after uh, when you're standing in the dining room goes towards the bedrooms all the light fixtures have been replaced in the home, and again, everything's been repainted recently. Uh, nice size dining room, I believe it's uh, 18 to 20 inch tile. And there's the opening looking into the uh, Arizona room. Standing in the dining room looking in towards the kitchen. Got a food pantry to the right on the other side of the breakfast bar. The current owners have opened this all up. The, there used to be a breakfast bar going across through
through the kitchen there. They took all that out, took the soffit out, and put this center island in. All the cabinets have been refinished with new handles on, new laminate countertops. You have reverse osmosis drinking water under the sink, and all the appliances have been replaced in the last, uh, I would say, four years. We don't get too many homes uh, in this community that have the real open kitchen, so this is really nice for entertaining. Standing in the extended laundry room slash den slash office, uh, looking back towards the dining room. They've uh, put new tile backsplash and uh, under the cabinet lighting in the kitchen and that window over the kitchen sink looks directly out to your covered patio and then your extended patio. There's a pocket door that closes off this laundry room from the kitchen. You have a sink in the laundry room with a cabinet. Cabinets above the washer and dryer. And this is the part that was extended and pushed out back beyond the edge of the house. They put a day bed in here uh, for an extra area for people to sleep and then this is a walk-in closet with a pocket door and they built an office desk in that closet it's a good size walk-in closet and then there's a door here to the left before you see that closet there um, that goes out to the back patio here is the Arizona room again this has its own heating and cooling system all these windows are brand new and uh, it's got its own condenser unit on the exterior Still standing in the Arizona room, there's your patio door that goes out to the backyard. And then this opening, it's all open, there's just a slight three inch step that when you enter this uh, Arizona room. And then you look back in to the kitchen. So headed down the hallway towards the bedrooms, there's a coat closet here to my left. And then towards the front of the home, if I make an immediately immediate left, here we are into the master bedroom. This whole master bedroom at build time of this home uh, the, was extended, I believe it was six foot. Uh, again, there's new arched uh, vinyl windows and uh, plantation shutters. Large double closets along this whole wall. Uh, all new laminate flooring. Beautiful master bedroom. This whole wall is closet space. Lots and lots of room in the closets. Here we are looking into the master bath. They've uh, raised the height of this cabinet, refinished the cabinets with new hardware, new countertops, new sinks, new faucets, and new recessed cans in for your lighting over the sink and then you've got a walk-in, step-in shower. Standing in the master bath, looking back towards the uh, master bedroom. I'm standing in the master bedroom, looking towards the guest bedroom, down the hallway and towards the guest bedroom. As we step out here, we got a large double closet to my right. Guest bedroom straight ahead. Just before I enter the guest bedroom is the guest bathroom, and I'll show you that shortly as well. Newer laminate floors in this bedroom. Again, updated ceiling fans. All the light fixtures, again, have been uh, replaced in recent years. Double closets, TV mounted in between the closets on the wall. Standing in the guest bedroom, uh, looking out towards the master bedroom, immediate right is the guest bathroom. Cabinets have been raised, new countertops, new sink, new faucet, new mirror, new light fixtures. And this is a full tub and shower.
Standing in the backyard looking up the west side of the home along the side of the garage, this is that gate I was telling you about with a spot to keep your garbage cans. This is all cemented out with a nice sidewalk. This backyard faces south and the current owners added this whole extended covered patio, poured the extra cement, epoxy coated the whole patio. Just a gorgeous setup for entertaining. They put in a built-in barbecue at the far east end of the patio. This was the original covered patio part. That window looks back into the kitchen sink and that's the door over there that goes into the laundry room extended den slash office area. They've got a TV mounted under here. Very nice for entertaining. Nice uh, five foot fence all the way around the backyard for privacy. And again, very low maintenance. This whole added awning is all aluminum, aluminum soffits, aluminum fascia. And uh, here is your uh, built-in barbecue. And this is your heating and cooling system for the Arizona room. And then you've got a new uh, heat pump that was added, like I said, a week ago. And this southeast corner of the home. Looking up the east side of the home, there's got that extra gate on the east side of the home. Sunscreen on this window over the bedroom. And then looking towards the west from your backyard. Again, my name is Jarl Kubot with West USA Realty and Arizona 55 Plus Communities. If you stumble into this video looking for a home for yourself uh, via YouTube, please go to my website, www.justjarl.com. There you'll find the current pricing of this home and everything that's included with the purchase price. So uh, go to the website, www.justjarl.com. You'll also find the links for all the homes for sale in all of the 55 plus communities surrounding Phoenix. There's over six of them so take your time and look through it. Give me a call at 480-710-6326. I'm sorry 480-710-6326. Uh, give me a call. I look forward to hearing from you and uh, I'd appreciate your business. Thank you very much.